We've got zombies all over us. Let's get in here and shoot these guys. Hey everyone, my name is Mike and welcome back to Dying Light. In the last part we climbed up that tower, you can just about see in the distance in the clouds there. Um, we sent a transmission out to the government to let them know that there were still survivors in the city. So just before we did that transmission, they were about to um, actually bomb the city, so it was a very close call. And now we're heading through the, the tunnels to head back to um, Old Town. I think we're probably going to meet up with Troy and see what the plan is now because I think we've got the uh, we've actually got the um, files now the um, research files about the the antidote you know the cure all right so I think we're heading our way back as well a different way to the way we got here because we went through the sewers when we made our way towards that tower and this time we're just going through tunnels that are pretty disgusting look like they smell pretty bad so Rise hasn't got many people with him now. We took out him to, to here in the last part. That was his like right hand man. And um, I think he's probably got a few henchmen still. But we don't really know where he's gone. Oh shit, I thought we could get out there. Alright, there's a ladder here we can hopefully climb up through. There we go. Here we go, made it to Old Town. Dr. Camden, this is Kyle Crane. Can you hear me? I can hear you. Are you on your way? I'm ready to work. Just bring me the samples. That's exactly what I intend to do, Doc. Just remember, I'm surrounded by an army of infected. Yeah, affirmative. Expect me soon. Good. Not like I'm going anywhere. So, Dr. Camden we never met before, and apparently he, um... He knows the way to, like, cure this disease. As long as he can get the research notes and the tissue fibers that we got for Dr. Zer. You know, Dr. Dr. Camden's been um, trapped in a pretty dangerous location for the whole time we've been playing the game. Inside Sector Zero. So, there's some enemies here. Some are Riser's men. We'll leave them to that. I think they've got a supply box there or something. They can have it. Alright, so we're kind of close to the area now where... Dr. Camden's supposed to be, and there's someone shooting guns. Who's shooting at us? Crap. Alright, so let's try and get around this side. Okay, maybe we can get inside here. Okay, there's guys with guns, knives. Let's get our guns out. We've got zombies all over us. Let's get in here and shoot these guys. me. Name's Crane. Use the elevator. Push the button for the bottom floor. Got it. Okay, so although people have been telling us that Dr. Camden is surrounded by like shit of zombies, that was no more than what we've seen before. That wasn't too dangerous really. So just press this button now for the elevator. Doesn't look like it's gonna be too difficult to actually get to him. Let's go for the bottom floor I think he said didn't he? It seems like the door's closed. We have to open it with the button. Let's pry it open. Alright, so this is what it all comes down to now. Getting this research to Dr. Camden. Hopefully, it'll have a cure. I, uh, hope you don't mind me reminiscing out loud like this. It's, uh, it's been quite a number of weeks since I've had the prospect of talking to an actual live human in person. Okay, maybe this is what they were talking about when they said that Dr. Camden is surrounded by zombies. It's actually inside the building. I think he's locked himself in. The door leading to the main corridor can only be opened manually. You'll, uh, you'll have to get to the security room and throw the switch. On my way. Okay. So to open that door there, we need to go to the security. I'm guessing it's one inside one of these doors. This is like a changing room. Can we access a vent to get there? These are like toilets, aren't they? They close symbols there, it's like men's, women's. There we go, there's a hole in the wall, ceiling even. Let's kill this guy. Alright, so let's get up here. This is a dead rat. A zombie rat. Let's 
don't know what that was. <laughs> Who's this guy? Ooh! <laughs> Shit. <laughs> Alright, so I need to hit the security switch. Found the computer that's working. I think it might be over here. There we go, keycard. Find a way to reach Dr. Camden. Okay, so we need to actually do something in here, I think. Okay. Is there another thing here on the desk? Unlock doors. Now, go down the main corridor. The lab is on the left. The outbreak happened. Sarah and I stayed in the quarantine to work on the cure. You know who was supposed to protect us? Kadir Suleiman. Rise himself. <laughs> that worked out just perfectly. Okay, the only way into the lab is through the decontamination room. The entrance is to the right. Everything went straight to hell after Rise's brother died, you know. Rise went from a guy with monstrous tendencies to a full-blown monster. You'll have to run the decontamination protocol to unlock the doors. It won't work without full power, though. That's where the generators come in. Head to the offices. Once you're there, I'll point you in the right direction. All right, I'm on it. Zara and I got to safety with the help of a GRE operative, a man very similar to you. The operative who helped us was supposed to evacuate alongside us, but you can, uh, you can guess how well that worked out, since Zara and I both got stuck here. Oh, be extra careful now. I never cleared the infected from that part of the facility, as I never had reason to go in there. I got separated from the two of them, but uh, I made it here to this clinic. I, I really had no other option than to work on finding a cure. Watch it. Opening the door. That's something he's opening the door for us. Here we go. So these are just like any other zombies. They're not difficult to kill. Oh shit, that was a mistake. Fuck. Shit, exploding guy. Oh my god. I think I just broke a computer. Use the vent system in the office area. Okay, so I need to go back up here again. I think it's this side. You'd think he'd have it all set up to get us in there, you know. It's probably on lockdown, isn't it? We've got to go all the way through security. You know, flip switches over this way, go that way to unlock this door. It's like a maze, this. Are we supposed to go in there? It's all green in there, it doesn't look safe. What if we go on around this side? Find a way to the generator room. So let's play the floor as lava then. Okay, we can't actually go any higher there. Can we actually walk on this? No. I'm not supposed to. There's a red door there, I got a strong feeling that's not gonna open. Yeah, didn't think so. Alright guys, I just killed all the zombies in the room. And um, if you look at this forklift here, it's blocking an air vent that's open. So if we use the forklift and bring it down, we should be able to get in there. There we go. Use our grappling cup to get up there. There's a big guy down there. Um, we may be heading through that door right there. Let me just quickly check if there's anything else behind us down this passageway. I think it was blocked off, wasn't it? Yeah, it's blocked off down the other side, so we need to jump down here. 
There's a big guy down here. I'm thinking we can use that forklift to raise the um, raise it up and go underneath it. Let's um, just get some distance between the guy first. Because if we don't need to kill him, we, we won't. Just because, you know, it's not necessary. There we go, press that button. Forklift is going up. Let's go around the guy. Let's go underneath the forklift. And see you, see you next time. Alright, so... Where are we going now? We need to find a way to the generator room. The windows are broken so we can jump inside. We stole the power source. Just click on buttons. Man, I hope two is enough. Good job. All right now, head back to the decontamination room. You know, I suspect even if Sarah had been able to leave the quarantine, he wouldn't have. He and the operative both felt the need to stay and help people. Okay, run decontamination process. There's a big guy coming. Jump sideways, run around him. Are we going back this way? Or do we have to go back the way we came? There's like a key card there. Jump back! Oh shit. So the guy's on us, the guy's on us. Try and avoid this guy as much as we can. You know, if we have to fight him, we will, of course, but if we don't have to, we won't. Oh, no way did he get me. I thought I was on the co behind the cover there. Let's um, run this way and heal up. See if we can get through the door now. Why didn't it? Did I not do the keycard properly? Okay, it's done it this time. It's opening. Go, 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 go. Oh, I'm pushing the button by the door to begin the process. Alright, so now we're at this door again. We can actually get inside now because we turned the power on. Some decontamination's going on right here. Oh, that actually kills them. Wow. Alright, now you can come in. Looks like the guy's inside here. shaking hands with you. Now, let's have those tissue samples, shall we? The doc, you mind if I show you a photo? No, 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 just, just, just one minute. it you wanted to say hey that's him that, that that's the GRE operative I was telling you about what's his name Amir yes yes Amir Goreshi what are you doing with a picture of him we uh we had a mutual friend the samples are still viable that's good with some luck your trip here won't have been for nothing uh, where's the rest of the data by the way I know Zara prepared two packages yeah, I'll have to get back to you on that, Doc. Right now I have some GRE shitheads to confront. GRE? Brain, you watch yourself around them. Their public face is a lie of epic proportions. Those people are all heartless, lying bastards. I hear you, Doc. And thanks. I'll be in touch. Okay, we're done now with Dr. Camden. First time meeting him. Give him the tissue samples. And there's still more that he hasn't got that we need to give to him. So I think we're just going to head out now and contact the GRE. I thought there would be more happening as we got to him for the first time. Hope we don't have to come all the way through here again to see him. Alright, back in the elevator. Listen, Crane, I gotta reiterate. You better watch your back, your front, and both sides with those GRE bastards. They'll screw you if they get the chance. I know, Doc. I'll be careful. 
I just need to figure out where things stand. One sec, guys. It's night time now, so it's pretty dangerous outside. I'm just going to set the waypoint. Of the, of the safe house is on the map already. Never mind. I just want to get to the safe house and get to daytime. So um, we don't get swamped by these, you know, super zombies at night time. God, this, gra this grappling hook doesn't half help, you know. It just makes things so much easier. Right, I'm just going to rest here first. Alright guys, it's daytime again now, so it's not as dangerous outside. Probably gonna look for a tall building now so we can contact the GRE. And um, tell them what's up. I think I'm probably just gonna tell them that we give this research stuff to Dr. Camden, and they probably won't be too happy about that. Because they want that for themselves, don't they? Oh my god, what the hell happened there? Alright, here's the tower now, we're looking to climb, I think. So we'll just zip line up the halfway up it. I think we can climb the rest. Here's a zip line again, if you can. It's on cooldown at the moment. Here we go. Hey Troy, I give the samples to Dr. Camden. Now I'm gonna go have a little talk with the GRE. And what are you going to tell them? Everything. I'll meet you later, Troy. This is Crane, do you copy? Kyle Crane, you can hear me, can you not? Rise. Where are you? Exactly where I should be atop my own tower. Of course, mine is not quite complete, but it still stands as a monument to chaos, to entropy, to what it means to be ruled only by oneself. I'll kill you for what you did to Jade. For everything, I'll fucking kill you! I had hoped that would be your attitude. You see, we are at war, you and I. A war of opposing philosophies. A war to see whose vision of the world proves true. Come, Crane. Come and challenge me. What is it you Americans are so fond of saying? I dare you. You know what? Forget it. There is no war. There's only your fucked up outlook. Go to hell. Oh, no, 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 no. I won't be going to hell. I will be leaving around, though, you see. I have made a deal with our GRE brothers, using your very own communicator, no less. They know I have all of Dr. Zera's research data. They call it the keys to the kingdom. Very shortly, a helicopter will come and take me away. Imagine the damage I shall be able to do outside the confines of these walls. Of course, if you think you can stop me. You crazy son of a bitch! That is what I had hoped to hear. Come and find me, Green. Let us finish what we began. You know, Rise is your, um, your typical bad guy, you know, he instead of just getting off and not, like, like leaving us in the dark, he's got to invite us for one last battle, you know. <laughs> he's not he's not clever, this guy, is he? Because obviously we're going to head over there now and we're going to whoop his ass. So the story's definitely coming to an end right now. If we pause it, you can see it's 92% and um, looks like we're going to face Rise on top of the tower. Maybe have a big battle with him, a boss battle, and that'll be the end of the game, maybe. So we'll find that out in the next part, guys. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye!